The Jeffersons 1975 cast — then and now 2023 — who passed away after 48 years. Hello. If you're anything like me, you're well aware that The Jeffersons is one of the most exceptional TV series of all time. So today I thought it would be fun if you put up a chair by the campfire and watch it again with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they change in 2023. Okay, let's see it together. Isabel Sanford was born Eloise Gwendolyn Sanford on August 29, 1917, in Harlem, New York City. She played the character Louise Jefferson in the series when she was 58 years old in 1975. Sadly, Isabel was hospitalized at Cedars Sinai Medical Center on July 4, 2004, where she died five days later, a month before her 87th birthday. Knew each other in New York. Roxy Roca, yes. Uh, but I didn't know him. Sherman Hemsley was born on February 1, 1938, and raised in South Philadelphia by his mother, who worked in a lamp factory. He played the character George Jefferson in the series when he was 37 years old in 1975. Sadly, on July 24, 2012, Hemsley died at his home in El Paso, Texas. He was 74 years old. And then it all came about with the writing. Like they give me an argument, then when you're home, you could be more yourself. You know, than, uh, you are. Roxy Roker was born on August 28, 1929, in Miami, Florida. She played the character Helen Willis in the series when she was 46 years old in 1975. Unfortunately, Roker died of breast cancer, in Los Angeles, California, on December 2, 1995. She was 66 years old. Anything that affects Lionel is going to affect us. You've said it yourself a thousand times. George can be stupid and wrong and you... Doesn't it? Makes it sound like a weird son. <laughs> no, but he was sort of theatrical, as you know. But um, he didn't like those little suits I used to put him in when we lived... Franklin Cover was born on November 20, 1928, in Cleveland, Ohio. He played the character Tom Willis in the series when he was 47 years old in 1975. Sadly, Cover died of pneumonia at the Lillian Booth Actors' home in Englewood, New Jersey, on February 5, 2006. He was 77 years old. Paul Benedict was born on September 17, 1938, in Silver City, New Mexico, the son of Alma Marie, a journalist, and Mitchell M. Benedict, a doctor, and grew up in Massachusetts. He played the character Harry Bentley in the series when he was 37 years old in 1975. Sadly, on December 1, 2008, Benedict was found dead of a brain hemorrhage at his home in Aquina, Martha's Vineyard, Massachusetts. He was 70 years old. Zara Cully was born on on January 26, 1892, the eldest of ten surviving children born to Ambrose E. and Nora Ann Cully in Worcester, Massachusetts. She played the character Mother Jefferson in the series when she was 83 years old in 1975. Unfortunately, Cully died from lung cancer, at the Cedars Sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles on February 28, 1978, at the age of 86. In your bread and salt, I have drunk your water and wine. The death he died, I have watched. <laughs> Worried about Lionel ever since Louise called. Has he come home yet? No, and I don't know what I'm going to do.
Ned Wertimer was born on October 27, 1923, in Buffalo, New York. He played the character Ralph Hart in the series when he was 52 years old in 1975. Sadly, Wertimer died on January 2, 2013, at the Sherman Village Healthcare Center in Los Angeles, at the age of 89. What? <laughs> My wife, I'm married to a PhD in Cal State University in history, and she's from Nigeria. Christmas in Port Harcourt, Nigeria, waiting at 12 o'clock midnight in Air France to board the plane, and a guy sitting across from us said... Damon Evans was born on November 24, 1949, in Baltimore. Evans attended the Interlochen Academy on a Reader's Digest scholarship. He played the character Lionel Jefferson in the series when he was 26 years old in 1975. Currently, He's living happily at the age of 73. Jay Hammer was born on November 16, 1944, in San Francisco, California. He played the character Alan Willis in the series when he was 34 years old in 1978. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 78. Danny Wells was born on April 7, 1941, in Montreal, Canada. He played the character Charlie in the series when he was 34 years old in 1975. Sadly, Wells died in Toronto on November 28, 2013 of cancer at the age of 72. Marla Gibbs was born Margaret Bradley on June 14, 1931, in Chicago, Illinois at Cook County Hospital. She played the character Florence Johnston in the series when she was 44 years old in 1975. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 91. After all, who is your favorite character from the Jeffersons TV series? What is this thing that they have that it is so appealing to you? And while we're at it, how do you feel about the actors who are no longer with us? Share your thoughts in the comments section below, and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for more content. And don't miss out on any of my future videos by turning on that bell notification.